Hello, we are going to talk about radiation risks. There are two type of effects. One is called the stochastic effect, also called as delayed effects, because these effects do not show up immediately. Best example for stochastic effects is cancers, radiation induced cancers in exposed individuals, usually observed 3 to 20 years after exposure. Second stochastic effect is mutations in offsprings of exposed individual. This can occur or observed in future generations. The second group or the second type of effects normally associated with the radiation is non stochastic effect also called as deterministic effect. It is also called as acute effects because these effects are observed within days to weeks and this occurs because the direct damage to tissues due to local cell death. And the non stochastic effects are um, do have a threshold dose below which you do not see this effect, but above which we are going to see this effect directly very straightforward increasing linearly. For example, in this patient images shown are some of this non stochastic effect. Non stochastic effects such as these were very rare, but can happen in an environment of interventional fluoroscopy especially fluoroscopy procedures which are very prolonged and if the same skin surface is exposed to large quantity of radiation dose that can trigger what is called as the non stochastic effect or the deterministic effect. Generally if the same surface received more than 2 gray of radiation that can set an onset a early transient erythema or early appellation. On the other hand the second category of uh, effect is the stochastic effect which is what we are all interested in imaging because stochastic effect as the name suggests is a probabilistic effect and the probability of the effect increases with dose, but the, the ult ultimate um, end product does not change with the uh, amount of dose. Example is radiation induced cancer and genetic effect. One of the best analogy we give is like for stochastic effect is playing lottery game. If somebody buys a 10 different tickets. 10 tickets they increase their chances of winning the jackpot compared to somebody having only one ticket. And the same analogy applies to stochastic effect also more number of radiation exposure or more number of events uh, the radiation exposure can have more chances of getting the stochastic effect. Under the stochastic effect we are worried about radiation induced cancer. In the radiation induced cancer risk are generally associated about 5 percent per sievert means the sievert is a large quantity of radiation dose. We normally work about millisievert of doses in imaging. Generally even though this graph shows a 5 percent per sievert as a uniform across the age in, in general we also see an age variation with respect to radiation effect. Children are 2 to 3 times at higher risk than adults compared to older population. So, the radiation risk especially the stochastic risk are of concern in medical imaging because of the dose level involved. Thank you.